Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve if you're having issues with your hard drive filling up very quickly or seemingly automatically for no reason on your Windows computer. So this tutorial will apply for Windows 10, Windows 11, and earlier versions of Windows devices as well. So if you notice your hard drive is filling up very quickly and there's not much storage space, I'm going to show you guys a couple of different ways on how to hopefully resolve that. First thing I would suggest, if you are able to, consider getting additional hard drive space through an external hard drive or if you can expand your actual physical storage. I'd recommend considering that option if you're using a smaller hard drive like a 64 or 128 gigabyte hard drive. You may want to consider upgrading. Besides that, and in most cases it's probably unnecessary to do that, but that's kind of like a worst case scenario. A couple other things we can try here as well. If you want to right click on the recycling bin and select properties. For custom size, you don't want to make this too large here. So you see space available 64 gigabytes on our hard drive. You probably don't want to make this more than like 5 or 10 gigabytes in size, frankly. So it's in megabytes, so you have to multiply your number times 1024. So for example, if we did 1024, Let's see, if you want to make the recycling bin 10 gigabytes in size, you can max it out at 10,240, for example, and that would limit it a bit. So if you do apply and OK, that's one thing you can do. Something else, if you open up the disk cleanup through the search menu, go ahead and open that up. And you want to make sure everything's checkmarked in here and select cleanup system files. You'll select OK. Are you sure you want to permanently delete these files? Select Delete Files. And once that's done, open up the search menu. Type in System Restore. Best result. Should come back with Create a Restore Point. Go ahead and open that up. And you want to select the Configure button. So where it says Max Usage, if it's all the way up to, let's say, 100% or 50%, for example, you may want to trim it back to like 10% at most. So I'll apply to save that. And where it says to delete all restore points for this drive, you can delete the restore points of all of them on there. And then select continue. And then you can go ahead and actually create a new one just by selecting the create button. And then create a restore point. Name it whatever you want. I'm just going to name it date. And then select create. And that's pretty much it, guys. So pretty sure we just cleared out the old restore points. So pretty straightforward process, guys. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.